In and out. What a cheeseburger. It's all about. You know what I am. I'm hungry. Can you get a uh, uh, three by three? And or, or triple triple. What do, what do most people call it? Uh, three by three. Three by three. Okay. Um, with uh, both kinds of onions. Mustard cooked. Extra tomato and extra pickle. We have a medium drink, one fry, three by three mustard fry, it's actually pretty That's crazy, it's still that cheap though. <laughs> like it, yeah, even with the pricing. Yeah, even with the increase, it's still cheaper than everywhere else. And it's good. And, yeah, and it's, and it's. Well, if we gotta order a burger, you might as well get a burger, am I right? Thank you, appreciate it. I mean... Oh my god. Here we go. Sprouts prices. On sale for four dollars for one ice cream sandwich. Otherwise it's on sale for five ninety nine for all the ice cream sandwiches. Like it's not the cheap place to shop anymore, bro. I mean come on, yeah. Meanwhile, at Trader Joe's as you can see, there's some that are five ninety nine, but there are some that are a heck of a lot cheaper than five ninety nine, including oh no, oh, those are the ones I want. The greatest ice cream sandwiches in history, man. Just figure when it. I mean, the prices. You can't even compare that. The sprouts, sprouts doesn't even come close. This is on sale for five ninety nine for all the ice cream sandwiches. Like it's not the cheap place to shop anymore, bro. I mean, come on, man. Oh, yeah. Which hand gets the sandwich? There we go. Oh. <laughs> uh oh. I waited for a lot of milk, but it's so good. Mm. Thank you. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, it's the cookie. The ice cream's great. And I, I don't even need all that chocolate around the side. I don't need... Sometimes I'm going to eat all four of them. I lick the chocolate off and then spit that out. <laughs> oh, really? Those are my sandwiches, yo. Winner! Oh. Uh, yeah. We forget them before they melt, though. Or, or it's all weird. Okay. <laughs> oh, yes. Frank the Piss Man at Wiener Schnitzel. He must be here for the fish. So, this is that. My fish and chips right there, I think. You didn't think you'd ever see me eat Wiener Schnitzel, but here I am eating fish and chips. And let's see if they're any good. Or, I mean, it's expensive. Let's just be honest, Wiener Schnitzel, if that's their sale, if that's their sale combos, that's expensive. Let's see how the schnitzel does fish, shall we? Uh, yes, please. Do you have mustard? Mustard, yeah. Mustard, mustard. Yeah, please. Just like one ketchup and a couple mustards. I'm a mustard fanatic. Awesome, thank you. I'm getting fish and chips at the schnitz. I feel like $9 worth of food? I don't know, we'll see. When in Rome. Am I getting a hot dog, though? Yeah, a strawberry root shake. Make it extra strong too if you can. Here at the Schnitz. Gonna get fish and chips. Where is it? There it is. So good. What's that? A strawberry a fruit loop shake and how to put strawberry syrup in it. Fruit loop shake? It sounds weird and gross. Is it really a fruit loop shake? It's one of the better things I've ever had. Fruit loop shake. They do have fruit loop shakes apparently. White chocolate stuff with sparkles that hardens on your ice cream. They mix that with the fruit loops. Wow. Your shake is ready, ma'am. Get that shake there. Getting the shake at the snitch. Uh, no, but it's good. Thank you, Just a type of winner, they didn't want it. What? I'm gonna float it, 
idea. Why don't I try the fish and chips? Here at the schnitz. Stepped into traffic for that. <laughs> but it was worth it, because I'm a filmmaker who's about to eat fish. It's a lot of apps. Let's hope they don't get an app. Rainer Central says that this is $9 worth of food. It is now, I guess. But it's hot. It's very hot still. All right, it's a decent piece of fish. It's a decent piece of fish. They got good tartar. Oh, a hot fish. Not bad. Their fries are okay. They're not terrible. Fish is pretty good. Oh, good. Eat them before they melt, though, or it gets weird. Hey, you. How you doing, now? Huh? Can I put you in my mouth? Is that all right? Like you a little bit, bro? <laughs> Sorry. I can't. I'm in a parking lot, for God. I'm in a Trader Joe's parking lot, for crying out loud. Because it's sublime, yo. You know it is. Whoops. Good news. For Andy Dick fans, I mean, for both Andy Dick fans, it looks like he's finally where he belongs. Can someone make sure there's a chaperone? And Frank Barris is America. <clears throat> when Frank Barris is America, there'll be free yerba mate for anyone who wants it. This is like legal cocaine, but like not bad for you. <laughs> Fuck that up. The key is to slice the garlic razor thin, so it liquefies in the pan. In a Frank Barris administration, yerba mate is going to be subsidized. Every citizen who wants one gets two a day. So I'm not sure I like this flavor. And we're going to find out by watching my face as I drink it. Ready? Do I like... Do I like the blue you chalk? We'll see. Ready? Yerba mate. I'm at a weird angle, so that was all just me swallowing wrong. That's what she said, my friend. Now give me back that Lucy Rose. I didn't really get that. Okay, there's notes of blueberry. Uh, there. What? That's the problem with being Frank the Pitch Man. I have to learn to drink sideways just so I can show you the can. See? Oh, oh boy. Wasted. I wasted my yerba mate telling you about how I have to drink my yerba mate sideways so you can see what I'm drinking. It's alright. I mean, it's blueberry. You wanna see a mosquito that I killed though? I killed that mosquito before, oh there he is. Remember when I killed you dude? Or, uh, I hate that it's female. I wish they were dudes so be like, fuck you, I killed you before you killed me. But it's like, they're all female, just trying to bite my, they just wanna suck on my blood. Sorry, I just didn't wanna give you my blood. Anywho. It's blueberry, it's not awful. The other brand adds elderberries. This is just, what do we get here? Yerba mate, cane sugar, so I took a blueberry and then goes right into the maltodextrin and then natural flavor, which could be anything. When it says natural flavor, that could be... You don't even want to know something. That could be my friend. Alright, is that terrible? It's blueberry. Enjoy it. So the good folks at Guyaki, so the good folks at Guyaki, they put elderberries in their blue. Who just put elderberries in the blue, yeah? Is that a good idea? I well, like. I mean, let me show you for a moment. Ah, oh. the elderberries make a difference. Why? <laughs> Why? Hello there. There's certainly notes of blueberry, but there's something behind the blueberry. Something dark and purple and delicious. We have a winner, folks. In the category of blue, you win. I mean, the kick is great. It is 160. Let me show you. 165. It's got 165 milligrams of caffeine. <clears throat> It has 165 milligrams of caffeine. I mean, holy mcschmookin' that. Am I right? A lot of caffeine, buddy. Thank you for having so much caffeine. I took a big swallow for you people. <coughs> and now I regret it. You're welcome. 
Every citizen who wants one gets two a day. Paid for by the government. And you're like, wow, what a waste of government money, but it isn't. The increased productivity from American workers. This should be free. For you and me. So are my two people? Am I haunted by the ghost of Frank Barish? Hi, how are ya? Nice to meet you folks. Or am I just Seth Aronson, the actor, and able to portray, hello there folks, I am Frank Barish, oh yeah. I don't know. I guess history will figure out what personality is weird when I both look at you, wait. I both, look at, I both, I both, I both. Ha, anywho. Now it's just going to the sky. And my family is missing Audrey. Like, I was thinking about Vicky and I think about Alex. I was thinking about Alex's baby. And how she needs her grandmother. And I'm yelling at the sky, why aren't you here? And then I realized that if her spirit really is floating above me, that hurts her more than it hurts me. And I said that, I said, that hurts you. That hurts you more than it hurts me, baby. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. storage unit doing this all the time George Washington grew it on his farm Jesus Christ put it in his anointing oil it is the most beneficial plant on the planet legalize it you have no jurisdiction over a woman's uterus Get in your lane, you hypocrites! Legalize it! Leave the women alone! Have a nice day! And I'm off. There's ten commandments. Look at that bullshit. Hypocrites. Alright, well, that's how I start my morning. Basically, this is, hey parents, are you really broke? Do you want to make a guinea pig out of your child for $2,800? For $2,800, we might kill your kid with our vaccine trials. But, you know, they bring home all kinds of germs and illnesses. A vaccine trial may help protect them. It may help protect them. It may, you know, give them a debilitating chronic condition because it's a trial. We're just tr we're testing it out on your children for $2,800. So, you know, if you need the money, bring us your kids. Thank you very much. That's my name. That's right. you for coming uh, because this is such an important uh, subject and as you just heard that's my name that's right <laughs> look it up you know what I am I'm hungry I smell chicken and that is how you mostly one-handed I use both hands to do the. Sorry. I got it on my chin like a weirdo. That don't mind me. I just got that on my chin like a weirdo. That's what she said, my friend. Now give me back that Lucy Rose. <laughs> Anywho, where. 